Hello everyone. Guess what today is? Today is my first day out of quarantine day. Yeah, so we are finally free and I decided to take you to a convenience store with me which is super far from where I live. Kidding. It is actually just downstairs. That's how convenient my apartment is but before we go there I want to teach you some Japanese words which we may use in buying from a convenience store I guess this is useful or helpful for those who are planning to visit Japan or even for some who simply want to learn Japanese so to start a convenience store in Japanese is called konbini. Convenience store, konbini. So the konbini where we are going is called Family Mart. In Japanese, we say Family Mart. I'm just say Family Mart. So here in Japan, there are lots of convenience store. We have 7-Eleven, Lawson, Family Mart, and I guess we also have Mini Stop. So yeah, the one where um, the one we're visiting or we're going is Family Mart. Upon entering the store, you'll hear them greet you with "Irashaimase." That means "Welcome to the store." You may also frequently hear this in restaurants. And take note. You do not need to respond to this. So again, irashaimase, welcome to the store. I guess the next few words that I'll be teaching you are the items that I want to buy from the convenience store. That includes Japanese rice balls, onigiri, Japanese fried chicken, karage, and orange juice orange juice so first onigiri onigiri or japanese rice balls from the word itself it is made of steamed rice covered with nori a seaweed sheet and some have furikake or seasoning some also have fillings like tuna chicken so yeah, onigiri. Next is karage or Japanese fried chicken. Karage. So in the convenience store, they'll ask you which flavor would you like. So there are two available flavors. One is shoyu. Shoyu means soy sauce. The other one is shio. Shio means salt. Next. I'd like to have orange juice. So orange juice, juice is juice, juice. Orange is orange. It's not that hard, right? So orange juice is orange juice. So yeah, those are the three things that I'd like to buy later. So onigiri, karage, orange juice. Okay, we are almost done. So while waiting in line to pay in the counter, you'll hear Otsugi ni narabe no kata dozo Otsugi ni narabe no kata dozo Or Otsugi no kata dozo Otsugi no kata dozo Both means next person please You don't have to memorize those words but you just need to familiarize for you to know that they are asking you to proceed to the counter So again Otsugi ni narabe no kata dozo. Otsugi no kata dozo. Um, they might tell you to wait. So you'll hear, Shosho omachi kudasai. Shosho omachi kudasai. That means, please wait. So you need to wait. Or, Omatase itashimashita. Omatase itashimashita. Omatase itashimashita. Meaning, thank you for patiently waiting. Or, thank you for waiting. 
So yeah, those are some few Japanese words. To wrap up, we have Irashaimase, welcome to the store. Otsugi ni narabi no kata dozo. Otsugi no kata dozo both means next person please. Shosho omachi kudasai. Please wait a moment. Omatase itashimashita. Thank you for waiting. And you know it's common here that they ask you for a point card when you pay. So that you might hear them say pointo kado omochi desu ka? But I guess for if they notice that you're a tourist or a foreigner, they won't ask you that. So yeah, I guess that's it. And oh, lastly, after paying, they uh, you'll hear them say arigato gozaimashita. Arigato gozaimashita. That means thank you very much. They don't expect you to say anything, but it's great if you can respond by taking a bow a little bit as a way of respect. So yeah, I guess we are more than ready. So let's go. I want to share how I love the distinct noise of a convenience store, the audible chatter, shuffling of products on shelves, high pitch beep of the barcode scanner, and advertisements playing on the background. I want you to feel that vibe too. On the left side of the entrance, you'll see a vending machine where you can buy your coffee, choco, or frap, then a space where you can eat, and then they also have a photocopier, a flower display, and then on the other side is where you'll find the magazines, cosmetics, and some personal hygiene kits. They also have an ATM machine inside. We passed by the toilet, which you can also use here inside the convenience store. Look at all these drinks. Amazing, right? Here are the medicines and an alley for the rice, easy to cook meals, condiments, there are also instant coffee and some more hygiene kits. Next, what Japan is known for, the cup noodles. They have a variety of cup noodles here. In Japanese, it's called kappu ramen. Now it's time for my favorite corner. All the chocolates, mm. you can find it here. More 
desserts and some snacks. Ooh, and ice cream. All the alcoholic drinks, you can find it here. Only ages 20 years old and above are allowed to buy these drinks. More ice creams. Now let's move on to some healthier options. remember our list so yeah I need to look for orangey juice I need to get my orange juice where is it oh, here it is it's for 97 yen that's around 38 pesos Japanese are known for being health conscious. They are really careful of what they eat and you can see that in their convenience stores. Just look at that. Another food on our list is onigiri, the Japanese rice balls. So yeah, I'm gonna get one. I am having a hard time choosing, so while I think, let me show you first the section for all the breads and pastries. There it is. I decided to get the one with the chicken and mayo filling so there and now for the karage or the Japanese fried chicken there you'll see two flavors the shoyu and shio soy sauce and salt guess today I'll go for the soy sauce one the shoyu He asked if we want the karage to be reheated and we answered it's fine. So we paid 550 yen for all three, that's around 220 pesos. And he also asked if we need a fukuro or a plastic bag, but I chose not to ask for one. finally home we had to rush back because it rained but i hope you guys liked what you saw that was a japanese convenience store and i hope we get to visit more places in the coming days we'll surely do that tomorrow my work resumes and it's gonna be a busy week but yeah let's enjoy life let's be more positive each day you guys take care of yourselves. We'll see each other again next time. Thank you so much for watching.